Beginning January 1st, Missouri was one of 19 states to enact a breast density notification law. What that law basically states is that if you have dense breast tissue and you are shown to have an increased risk for developing breast cancer, then you may benefit from additional testing or additional studies. This year, when a woman receives her results, it will state not only if her mammogram is normal or abnormal, but also if she has dense breast tissue or does not have dense breast tissue. Breast density refers to the amount of glandular tissue in relationship to the amount of fat in the breast. Studies have shown us that it can be more difficult to interpret a mammogram in a woman who has dense breast tissue. And also, women with dense breasts can be at a slightly increased risk for developing breast cancer. It's important to note that just because a woman receives notification that she has dense breast tissue, it does not mean that she has breast cancer or will develop breast cancer. If a woman is shown to have dense breast tissue and she is at an increased risk for developing breast cancer, well then she may benefit from additional screening tools. Examples of those would be a breast MRI, breast ultrasound, and tomosynthesis. Step one is getting your screening mammogram. Step two is determining if you have dense breast. Step three would be, are you at an increased risk for developing breast cancer? And if so, maybe some of these additional tests would be beneficial. If the patient receives a notification and she doesn't have dense breast tissue, she has a normal mammogram, end of story, then we'll see you next year. Now the law is not meant to increase the level of anxiety. It's strictly meant to raise the level of concern and begin discussions with your physician about the possibility of having increased risk for developing breast cancer.